Denver Police. Two Colorado nonprofits are partnering together to combat mental health crises in ER patients before they happen. McKellia White spoke with one of them about this new tool they're using to help break the stigma. National data is showing that ER rates are up during the pandemic. Robert Bramer is with Colorado Access, a nonprofit that helps Coloradans get affordable health care. He says, though many thought we'd be past the pandemic, times are still tough right now. Let's be honest, we're all under just a heightened level of stress and anxiety in the world that we're living in, the pandemic, all kinds of things going on in our world right now. It just feels more uncertain. Suicidal ideation is one of the top 10 reasons for ER visits among Colorado Access members, and there's an increasing need for screening and intervention before health crises arise. That's why the organization is trying to expand its efforts by partnering with local nonprofits like Planned Parenthood of the Rocky Mountains. Screening 100% of the patients that come into the clinic, and that's important because we, we miss, we're not very good judges sometimes of uh, someone's depressive symptoms. Using a validated screening tool and survey, they'll be screening every patient that comes into the facility. Kind of a, equated to a blood pressure. Anywhere you would go and see a doctor or, or a healthcare professional and expect them to take your blood pressure, we should expect our behavioral health status to be checked as well. The objective is to avoid an ER visit in the first place by checking this important vital sign. It reduces stigma. The more that we ask about it, the more it normalizes it, the more it makes it less scary, the more you feel comfortable talking to your provider about it because they're asking. In Denver, I'm Michaela White covering Colorado First.